this is my review of the Fairweather finger tab. So this is a unique tab, a very unique tab on the market. It's uh, It's been handcrafted by Olympic champion Simon Fairweather. Um, it consists of as few pieces as possible and it's all held together by the one screw. So this is a great advantage in terms of tabs as, um, as archery is a highly technical sport. So you don't want to be worrying about tabs or screws falling out of uh, a finger tab in the middle of a competition. So this is very simplistic. So it basically consists of the tab itself, which I have been using for a little over a week now. I've shot about 150 arrows with this one. And you can see it's already taking a shape to um, to, to the, the string wear. And that's because this is a, uh, it's kangaroo leather. So all three pieces here um, are pieces of kangaroo hide, whereas typically in the past, uh, finger tabs would have utilized cordovan. Um, and that's just because cordovan doesn't absorb water when wet or it doesn't do anything funny in different weather conditions. And as far as I understand, kangaroo leather is very similar. But the advantages of uh, kangaroo leather is that it's soft yet durable. Um, so, and it, and it is used in all of these pieces here. Um, so we'll just break it down for you here. So there's the two plastic pieces on either side of the leather. So three different pieces of leather. And you can see from me securing these down that it's already very soft. Like you see here, it's all untouched. But if I was to scratch it with a fingernail, see there, it just puts a line in it. So that's just it. Just means it's very soft leather, and it's uh, it's great. It provides a great feeling on the string. And you see on the inside of these plates, there's all these pegs and holes, and they just correspond with one another. They go through the leather, and it basically eliminates the need of having to put screws through the leather into the plate. And this is a, a very revolutionary idea, as far as tabs go. So I've got the the large tab and then the spacer itself I've got a, a 23 so as you can see the the spacer itself and the ring are one piece so this 23 just relates to the circumference of my finger um, so that provides a very comfortable fit on on my finger um, as I measured this up before ordering it so it's all held together by the one screw, which comes in the spacer when it's ordered. It comes in two identical packages like this. So you see here, there's a bit of information on the back. If you can pause that there, you can have a read of it. But um, if you want to get in contact with Simon about the product, uh, he's very responsive and he's very good to talk to. Um, and then for ordering, the worldwide distributor of these is Pat's Archery in Australia. And it retails for about 100 Australian dollars. Um, so I'll just assemble it together here for you now. But it's a, it's a great design. It's, it is very revolutionary and it's one of the, the most simple tabs I've ever owned. But that's not a bad thing. Because I've, I've had to stop using tabs because I've just lost screws and at the worst times as well. So, And unfortunately a lot of these companies are capable of making a, a little bit of extra money out of you by charging for extra screws so you see there the holes and the pegs la match up and then they all just peg together like that now I just will pause here and just show you this something I've noticed and I'm not sure if this is intentional or not but um, in terms of putting the spacer into this pocket here if you were to put it straight down it leaves a slight bit of overhang here. So you see that that just comes right out. Whereas I found when I was playing around with it, that if that goes down and slides in, it'll provide a much more secure fitting on that side. Now realistically, it wouldn't make much of a difference. Like that's very snug there, no matter which way it's in. Or if that's just mine, or it is an intentional design feature. Well, that's just what I've noticed with this. And the one screw goes through both plates and it lines up perfectly with the the bushing inside of the 
spacer. So and that just tightens right down. So you see there it all combines into the to the Simon Fairweather tab. Uh, so flexible enough it fits comfortably on the hand. Um, and then the shelf is molded into the front plate as well, so that's just eliminates moving parts and extra screws. Uh, if you want more information on this tab, um, you can either go to Simon Fairweather. Um, you can reach him on Facebook. Facebook. He's very, um, it's very easy and very helpful to communicate with in terms of this product. Um, and then you can talk to the distributor, uh, Pat's Archery, and they're very friendly people over there. So if, um, if you're considering ordering one or have any questions about the product, go by all means and talk to them. But uh, yeah, that's my review of this. 